I am talking to his UFC. I had to mute him. Okay, well, he's done doing that. One is underway. Joe, it's been well documented that there are some major rule differences between competing in Pride and competing in the UFC. And Shogun Hua is one of those guys who has to overcome those rule differences because he's not going to be able to do some of the things he did successfully in Japan. That, and he also has to avoid some of the things that they couldn't do in Japan, like elbows from the top. That's a big deal, Mike, and uh, it cuts a lot of fighters who aren't prepared for them. Joe, Chuck Liddell doesn't like being on his back here. No, he doesn't, Mike, but he's one of the best in the world at getting up from that position. Leg kick by Shogun. He's got the clinch again, which is what he wants. Body shot pushing forward quickly. They call them punches in bunches, and Chuck Liddell might be the best. Chuck Liddell is one of the best at finishing an opponent. When he's got a guy hurt, he swarms on him. Boom, right, and down he goes. Under three minutes now. And he decides to let him up. Missed that shot. Trying to find the range. He shoots. Good takedown. Shogun gets taken down. Shogun's got to be careful here. Midway through round number one. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. The best way to neutralize Chuck Liddell's attack game is to get him down and keep him down. Absolutely. If there's any one spot where Chuck Liddell is vulnerable, it's when he's on the ground on his back. Side control again. Joe, this building is electric. What a classic matchup. Under 90 seconds remains in round one. Full mount. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> Just over a minute remains in round one. Joe, look for that Kimura here. He's got to secure his hand on his wrist. Oh, he lost it. Nice escape. He decides to let him up. Just missed. Oh, they're going to close it up again. Right to the clinch. And you can get knocked out by one of those. Absolutely. He's got to be very cautious here. Takes a couple to the body. Knees to the thighs. Both men scoring points here. 15 seconds on the clock. Knee inside. He pulls guard. Final seconds of round number one. What a great brawl in that round. Both fighters leaving everything inside. Let's take a look at... Oh, yeah, right. He's tired. The reason we rolled him? Yeah. Okay, yeah, he can't push yeah, the pace. He can't he can't see your right hand. The lovely. Yeah. Are you ready? Are you ready? We are set for the start of round number two. This fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. The Iceman, Chuck Liddell, still, Joe, one of the most feared strikers in the history of the UFC. He has ruthless knockout power in each hand and each foot, and he's very confident about it. That's one of the things that makes him so dangerous, is that he absolutely knows all he has to do is connect and you go out. He lets him up. The Iceman, Chuck Liddell. He can take a punch, and we've seen him take it before, but when you throw that punch, you better watch out for what's coming back. He has excellent counters, Mike, and he's great at staying in the pocket. Big right hand. Headshot. Anytime he's got you in the clinch, you're in trouble. Shogun is very good in the clinch. Shogun is awesome in the clinch. His Muay Thai knees are devastating. And he lets him back up. This is where he's so dangerous, Joe. Jumps in the guard. He's working the rubber guard. Three minutes remains in the second round. Reversal. Very nice. Got him inside control now. And the knee to the midsection. There he goes. Back Joe to mount, mount again. Chooses to go back to side mount. He's eating some punches. North south. Looking for a shoulder lock. He's going for the Kimura. No, he lost it. Let's him up. Two minutes left in the second. The clinch game once again. Chuck Liddell is an outstanding Kempo kickboxer, which means he has Muay Thai skills. But part of Muay Thai, Joe, is, is working in those tight quarters and the elbows and the dirty boxing. Chuck would rather push away, though, and keep distance, wouldn't he? Well, he likes to have a nice, uh, nice amount of distance to set up those big strikes, big punches, and big kicks, but he's also capable of fighting in close. I'll stumble him that time. Got that one through. 
You've got double underhooks working in the clinch. They clinch again. Pulls guard. Oh, he's going for the rubber guard. 30 seconds remains in the round. Great job on the reversal. He's looking to work oh, that I choke. And he's out. Nice escape. We're headed around three, it would appear, though. Oh, he lets him up. So you always see the overhand right and the counters from Chuck Liddell, but still his kicks can end a fight. In Let's take a look at somebody. Find those punches. Hey, and find the knees right now. I want fours and fives. With we are set for the third and final round of this non-title matchup. The fans love Chuck Liddell because he knocks people out. And also, I mean, how can you not be impressed with a fighter who has a mohawk and tattoos on his head? <laughs> Looking for a submission. Trying to lock up the knee. He's got to Oh, he escaped. Very nice escape. He's going for a guillotine. No, oh, lost it. Got to watch for the up kick. And he decides to let him up. Looking for the knockout punch. See if somebody can come up with an elbow in this tight position. Again, he locks up. They clinch again. Inside with the clinch again. Good body kick. He's trying to pass. He's nice got half gun. guard. Back to side control. Caught him with the kick. Uh, they're going to close it up again. Right to the clinch. The clinch game once again. He jumps guard. Smart move. Let's see what he can do from here. Joe, let's see what he tries to do from here. Rubber guard. Inside the guard. Posturing up. And into side control. Oh, he got reversed. Got the double underhooks. Uppercut. Bang, and right back, back to guard. guard. Well, it looks like he's got a hold of a guillotine right here. Nice escape. And he's got he's side, side control. control. A knee again. Joey's going to try to work for a Kimura, it looks like. Good defense. He decides to let him up. 115 remains in the fight. One minute remains. He lets him up. 45 seconds remains. Nice leg kick. Good leg kick. Trying to come over the top. 30 seconds remains in the round. Joe looking for the takedown here. And another takedown. Joey's going to be careful. Yeah, wow. He's, it's, and he's got the guard. He's got one. Very wow. nice escape. Round's going to come to conclusion. Transitions to north-south. That is the end of the third and final. Let's take a look at some... The judges have... Third one from RFBox.net.